Welcome, everybody, to an adventure that we are about to take. Sort of a, a sample of an adventure. <laughs> we are going to be playing the Oninaki demo on Nintendo Switch. Uh, before we hop into this, uh, I'm just going to go ahead and roll out a, a quick little update while this beautiful menu music plays in the background. So, uh, basically... I uh, recorded Final Fantasy VII Remake demo, my PlayStation, and my PlayStation for about like the past mm, like maybe month, month and a half or so has been experiencing like really bad problems where I don't know if it's overheating or whatever it is, but like it'll just like I'll be playing and first at first it was just like I would be playing Modern Warfare and then my console would just like shut down. Like, I really couldn't even play it, and then it would just shut down, and it just started doing this out of nowhere. And so, ever since then, my PS4 has slowly gotten worse, and it recorded and played through the entire Final Fantasy VII demo. Final Fantasy VII, a game that you would think is uh, pretty demanding on the console. Played through that perfectly fine, and then I was going to play some Minecraft with one of my good friends and record that and just kind of mess around and stuff. Um, and then I couldn't even play Minecraft. Minecraft of all games. And my console just crashed and was shutting off. And so basically what I've had to do now since it's, you know, this is, uh, you know, kind of the, the sacrifices that I have to make, quote unquote sacrifices, um, in order to be able to do, like, my recordings and streaming, and then on top of that, just all of the games that I have on my PS4, basically, I had to go and buy a new one. Um, so, I don't want to, like, drag this out longer than it has to be, but I bought a new Slim, or a used, like, new Slim off of Amazon that will be getting here by Monday, next Monday, and I'm just gonna transfer everything over from my old console over to the new one, and hopefully I won't have to deal with any more problems until the PS5 comes out. And then hopefully when the PS5 comes out, there's like a really good trade value deal that they'll have where you'll be able to trade in your old consoles. And hopefully I'll be able to get like half of what I paid for this new Slim in, in trade value. Um, but anyway, I just wanted to go ahead and let you guys know that um, the next like week of uploads is going to be... Um, just games on my Nintendo Switch, um, which I mean shouldn't be a problem. I have some really cool games on there that I mean, and I've been wanting to record some some videos using my Switch anyway. Um, but just know that I won't be using my PlayStation um, at least for another week. But anyway, without further ado, let's go ahead and hop in to the Oninaki demo story mode. <laughs> Ooh, choose the level of difficulty. You can also adjust difficulty after starting the game. Casual, an easier difficulty for those who mainly want to enjoy the story. Eh, no. Normal, a difficulty that offers challenging gameplay and tactical fighting. It's more my style. Maniac, a difficulty with intense battles that features higher item drop rates. The difficulty does not affect the story. You know what? It's only a demo. Why don't we go ahead and just hop right into Maniac. Get a taste for what this game can offer. The beginning of the game is identical to the full game, and your save data can be carried over. To the oh, that's pretty cool. Note that Kagachi's level and the number of skills you can acquire are limited in this mode. Nice. You know, I actually really like demos that allow you, that, like, are just, like, the beginning of the game, and they allow you to bring over the save data and everything to, like, when you get the full game. I've been looking at this game um, ever since it's... I mean, okay, I wouldn't say that I've been keeping my eye on it and everything, but I saw it in the store in the Switch store and saw that it was... Oh, I had to press A. Well, the suck. The big suck. Uh, I saw it in the Switch store and it had a demo, which it did not have when it initially released and everything. And I'm pretty sure it didn't have one for a little while. Um, but I saw it and I was like, well, if there's a demo for it, then um, I'm going to go ahead and cop that and give it a shot. So... Oh, whoa. A soft rain fell the day my parents died. Wait, is this... Oh, he's doing a Japanese... What the... Okay, 
Okay, I'm pretty sure I don't need to reread that in English, because the Japanese dub is there to back me up. <laughs> Thanks, Japanese guy! I kind of like the art style. It's kind of... I kind of like the... Yeah, I kind of like the art style. Don't be sad, Kagachi. I'll go talk to my daddy. He's a watcher. He can talk to dead people. Maybe he can talk to your mommy and daddy, too. No, don't. I'm okay. Yes, run, Kagachi, run. Oh, look at the poor little girl. Look at the poor little girl. Ugh. I don't know if I'm going to get the full game of this. It's uh, a little bit expensive, and obviously after dropping, like, nearly $300 on a new PlayStation, <laughs> kind of not feeling a new game right now. However, if the gameplay of this is very enticing, along with the story and everything, I, uh, I very well may go for it. What in the world is going on right now? Who's the blondie? Excuse me. Hey, little girl? Hello? What is going on? Don't touch my butt. Wait, what? What's happening right now? She looked at us, bro. Who's there? It's you. Huh? Who? But why aren't you whole? Whole? What? What are you talking about? Are you okay? That girl knows me. Question mark. What girl? She was just... Uh... Help him, Daddy. Help him, Daddy! Hess! Help me! Come, Kagachi. Uh, excuse me, what? Alrighty. How many cutscenes are we gonna see before we get into the game? Quite curious. Now, this is goodbye for your mom and dad. But you mustn't grieve for them. Why not? Why can't I be sad? Grief fills the dead with regret, my boy. When the dead carry regret, they lose their way, and those who are lost cannot be reborn. They can't? No, son, they can't. Those who are lost lose their souls and cannot be reborn as people. Reincarnation is the way of our land. To be lost is to go against the natural order. Do you understand? Yes. Yeah. Accept it for what it is, Kagachi. Accept. Acceptance. Yeah, I think so. Good. Then there is still a path for you. Ah, yes. Yep, and everybody just goes on their merry way. Look at that. That's lovely. Forget about the kid that just lost his parents. Awesome. Great. Damn, 20 years later, huh? Alright. Hmm. 
Alright. I just want to experience this hack and slash gameplay, brother man. Come on. Come on. Oh, there's David. David playing Super Smash Bros. Ooh. You. Ooh. Wow! Mayura matured into uh, quite the lady, didn't she? <laughs> ah, yes, and Kagachi with his. Whoa. What is go. Whoa! Alright, main menu, move, use incense, sheath, draw, basic attack, skill one, demon action. Alright, time to die. What's happening? Passionate Aisha. Ah, a passionate and caring demon. Aisha has been at Kagachi's side since he first became a watcher. She still holds distant memories of fleeting happiness and an intense longing for love. Aisha can dash to move quickly across the battlefield and sword she wields strike fast and hard, making her a well-balanced warrior. Ah, well, isn't that lovely? Yeah, you! Time to die, mother... Boom. Alright, time to... Yeah, you! What did it say? B? Did it say B was the demon action? I tried using B and it didn't do anything. What the heck, man? I see you've taken care of things here. Thank you. Well done. Why are you so nice to them? They're just another weapon. Watch what you say! Demons used to be people. People with feelings. Yeah, used to be. Fine, have it your way. Let's just finish the mission. It looks like the lost soul we seek is a little boy. Did Leo fill you in on this story? I hope he's ready to hear what we have to say. I'll handle it. If I've said it once, I've said it a million times. You really need to change your attitude. Why does that sound like my mother? <laughs> The feelings of the living make the dead lose their way. Or have you forgotten? The lost are already lost. You are just impossible! Come on, let's go. Come on, baby girl, you can't be mad at me. Come on now. Minimap. The minimap at the bottom right of the screen displays your current surroundings, showing areas you can reach and the location of your next objective. You can change the size of the minimap by pressing L. So here's what I'm wondering. Is this a more linear game, or is it more open world? Because it's giving me vibes that it's kind of open world-ish, but I'm not quite sure. Oh, the demon action. I think in the bottom left, I think that's what the demon action is. Ooh, so it's best used in a line. Mm, me likey likey. Well, that did nothing. Hello? Anybody here? To get... What was that? Go ahead and sheathe that boy. Oh, wow, you move way faster when you're sheathed. Holy balls. The balls of fire have spoken, and they have determined that you, sir, are stupid. Yep. Time to die. Ain't no crow looking ass gonna kill me, bruh. I like the, uh. I like the. I like the visuals, and I definitely like the combat. The combat's pretty nice, actually. Yaw, yeah, yeet! Yeah. Boom. Dang, man, that demon action kinda takes a little bit to, to fill up, though, doesn't it? I mean, it's more or less. Probably about the same charge rate as, like, the, uh, the Rage Meter in the God of War games. Probably about the same deal. Ow! Whoa! Big fuck! Big, big... <laughs> big Chungus! <laughs> Time to die! Ouch. 
Don't hit me, good sir. Who do you think you are? Time to die! That's what I think. the heck out of my face. Living world, the beyond. The living world is the land of flesh and blood. A natural world brimming with life, where creatures high and low rejoice in being alive. The beyond. The land of the dead. A world that exists in parallel with the living world. Occupying the same space, separated by a thin veil. Press ZL to move between the living world and the beyond. The first time you travel to the beyond in a new location, you will be a veil blind, preventing you from sensing your surroundings. You are vulnerable as long as you are veil blind, so any attacks you suffer are fatal. What the hell? A nexus appears when you defeat a sight stealer, a rare type of fallen that appears wreathed in a noxious miasma, or miasma, however you want to say that. I'm pretty sure it's miasma. If you cross the veil near a nexus, your veil blindness will be lifted in this region above of the beyond. This also bestows special effects on this person precepts on you and the fallen within so wait a minute nexus appears when you defeat a sight stealer a rare type of fallen that appears wreathed in a noxious miasma if you cross the veil near a nexus this will be okay i got you cool um oh mama theta i understand now yes go into the beyond Ooh. Hot mama. That looks pretty cool. The little boy. Hand him over. Or die. Always critically hit. Well, frick. That doesn't sound good. Oh! You think you can just do whatever you want, huh? Yeah, I bet you also think you're pretty cool. Well, you're not, buddy. I probably shouldn't technically be doing this, but... Level up, Lou. Soul stones. Soul stone acquired. Soul stones, soul stones form as a sign of the, de the deepening possession of your demons. The more you use your demons, the more soul stones you can acquire. Press mm, the options button to open the main menu, then select demons, followed by skill tree to use your soul stones. Alrighty. Um, yeah, I already kind of forgot what it said. Oh, demons. And then... Wait, what? Oh, skill tree. Okay. Gotcha, 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 gotcha. The skill tree is a visual depiction of a demon's soul. You can use soul stones on the skill tree to acquire new skills and abilities for each demon. After acquiring a skill, you can assign it for use in battle using change skills on the demons menu. Assign it for use in battle using change skills. Okay. Cool. So let us see here what do we want. Alright. Aisha's memory is sealed within. Oh dear. Simsar shifting to Aisha takes less time. Oh, that's not what I and blah 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 blah. Increase affinity after manif manifestation ends. Always applies when Aisha is in the party. Okay. Skills triggered while manifested gain a manifestation effect. What an interesting thing. Oh, I can do that, huh? Why don't we do it? Yeah, sure. Unlock her her demon lore. Plebs. Select demon lore to watch. I'm gonna do that. Recovering a demon's memories allows them to share... The, Allows them to share most of their past with you, strengthening your bond. Examine the waystones you find and select Demon Lord to view their memories. Oh, uh, so you have to be at like a, a waystone or something for that to work. Increase the power of skills used immediately after a basic attack hits. Evade for longer when dashing? Um, excuse me, what? Uh, increase affinity gain when you use healing incense. Um. Well, it hasn't taught me dashing yet, but I'm assuming that that would probably be uh. Yeah, we'll just do this. It's a demo. 
I mean, even though the save can carry over, you know, we'll play like we're playing a demo for right now. Shift. Oh, B is dash. I don't understand, dude. What do you mean? Alright, hey, here's the frickin' deal, bro. Alright, don't come after me. Alright, because if you come at me, I will end your life. Yaw yeet. Frickin' stupid bird, where are you looking at, bro? Oh, is this a waystone? That's definitely not a waystone. What a waste. My balls itch. That's not true. I don't know why I said that. Don't listen to me. Oh, there we go. Gee, I thought I could friggin'... I thought I could friggin' frick, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, you! Woo! The damage received on that was mega, mega, meg, meg, meg. Do not hit me with your fireballs, mate. I don't very much appreciate that. I'm a man of... Whoa, dude! Oh my gosh! I just freaking destroyed that. Hey, that's cool. Look at that. Demon lore. Demon, demon lore. Show me the demon lore. Show it to me. Can you only find those waypoints, the demon lore things, in the beyond? I think maybe it's restricted to the beyond. I could be wrong, though. Ooh. Ah, yes. I can totally relate. Never, huh? Oh. That is sad. That is the ultimate depression. But unfortunately, we must move on. Because you are my demon. And we must destroy. Okay, cool. Anything else back here? No? Yeah, alright. Well. So... This incense thing is healing? Why can't I use it? What the heck? Hello? It won't let me use it. I don't know. That's weird. Well, it looks like I can. That's... Do I need to... Use... Oh, it's because I have full health. I'm an idiot. You know what? Sometimes these things happen, alright? Shut up. Yes, Schmeath. Schmeath the Shord. So you're the little boy. Who are you? We're watchers. We've come to send you off. Send me off? Am, am I dead? I'm afraid so. We're here to help you pass into the next world. Do you have anything you want to tell us? Anything you're sad or upset about that might, keep, that might be keeping you here? I'm worried about my mom and dad. I don't want them to get lonely without me. No point worrying over it. You can do any you can't do anything about that while you're dead. If it upsets you that much, work on getting reincarnated and fix it in the living world. Uh, I guess you're right. I'm the one who died. It's my fault. Mm. That's not what we're saying. This isn't about blame. Think before you speak, Kagachi. Yeah, you frickin' jerk knob. 
Okay, but before I go, I want to see my mom and dad one more time. Is that okay? Just once, please. Please? What should we do? Mm. Sure, let him see them. All right. Come along, little boy. Okay, listen. We'll take you to see them. You really mean it? But in return, this has to be goodbye. Are you ready for that? Yeah, I promise. <laughs> Where should we go? To your house? Yeah, they're probably at home. My house is this way. Then let's go. Yes, let us now venture forth. Hey, whoa! What you, what you, whoa! The, what the crap are you doing, boy? I'm gonna kill you, bro. Don't ever come at me again with that bull. Yeah, you. Oop, dear. Oh my gosh, I killed it before it could get off the the the, the thing. Is that a, is that a freaking potion of healing? A healing incense? Too bad I'm too good at this game. Which means I cannot die. I don't need to be healed because I already got my oh, balls. Hurry up and use your crap, broski. Yeah, yeet. Boom. Get schmacked. Schwacked and bush macked. Another healing incense, bro? I don't need your healing incense, bro. I'm playing this on Maniac and this is what you give me? How disappointing. Yeah, what am I, what am I told you that I can't... Wait, what did I take damage from? What in the world? Healing incense times three? Dude, what in the crap? What are you expecting me to do? Suck the suck suck? Take the big smuck? Oh no, do not. Do not. Do not attack me. I will end your exempt and exist and I'll end your existence. Ow! What did I tell you about hitting me? Another demon? Is this more demon lore thing? I don't think that this is necessarily a demon lore thing. I think it's just a... Yeah, it's just a thing to, like, save and stuff. Oh, that's cool. So it's just the general save station. Good to know. Yeah, yeet! Wait, do you regen health out of combat? Is that the deal? Dude, that makes this unbelievably easy. Why would you do that? I mean, like, I can understand why, but, like... Ooh, ooh. I don't know what you're saying to me, um, but I don't appreciate it. Whoa! All right. Well, this is uh, what the heck? What the heck's happening? Oh! Ooh, 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 ooh. Affinity reflects the depth. Reflects the depth of possession with a demon. It rises during battle and falls when you use skills. High affinity increases your attack, but if it goes over 150, it, de it decreases defense. So tread carefully. Okay, interesting. When affinity is 100 or higher, you can press L to manifest. When you manifest, your stats increase even further. You can cancel all actions and damage will not stagger you. While manifested, affinity becomes the manifest gauge. Um, when the gauge reaches zero, manifestation ends. Um, cool. Real cool. I keep getting hit by stuff, man! I don't appreciate this crap! Quit hitting me, boy! What do you think you're running off to? You buffoon? <laughs> oh no! Use healing incense to recover HP. HP recovers automatically outside of battle, so use this when locked in combat. You'll find healing incense in chests or on fallen enemies. You can use as many as you have. Level up to increase the number of healing incense you can carry. Okay, so it's mainly specifically for the idea of healing that boot. Hey, that boot. Okay, okay, all right, relax. Jeez. I'm over here trying to live my frickin' life, and you're trying to bone me. Frickin' relax. Yeah, you. Might as well heal. I don't have any other use for it. Hello! We meet again. I already killed you in the other world, but might as well do it again. 
I kind of like this game, I'm not going to lie. It's, it's, I don't know. Like, it feels, I don't know, it feels good. It feels, it feels good. I like it. Who dares stand in my way? Time to die! Okay, so, press L, right? Is that what it said? Yeah, I don't really know, like, I kind of want to use this on a boss. Is there a boss? Ah, well, speak of the Duvle. I'm about to end your world, dude. Your world will become ended before you can even say cheese Fritos on a burrito. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Time to die! Swordstone. Ah. Am I still manifested? What's the deal here? Dude, I'm actually really liking this right now. It's pretty dope. Yeah, yeet! Boom. Um... I don't know if I want... Do I want to, like, go... Oh, well, okay, well. Let's pass through the veil. Ah, yes, the volley. Um, yeah, yeet. <gasps> Excuse me. And then let's go back and kill everything. Hope you don't mind if you die. Oh, wow, I completely missed that. That was sad. I was sad in every respect of the word of sadness and depression and anxiety and disappointment and failure and sadness and disappointment. Ooh. What is that? Oh. Okay. Another healing incense. Y'all really like to piss me off with that healing incense, cur. Alright. Alright, hey, the portal. Ya yeet. Cross into the world of the over of the overworldness. Alright, I mean I think that we should save, I guess, if we can save with this, right? No smave. Smave, please, thank you. In order to ease the boy's heart and send his soul on to where it belongs, Kagachi and Mayu and Ma Oh boy. Kagachi and Mayura bring him to see his parents. Oh dear, who are you? Do I have to fight you? Sorry, what? Wait, what? What's... Uh, what? What happened? Is this a... Oh, am I about to get a new demon? Hmm? wonder how many demons can... Possess you at one time. Might be only one. Yes. Great job, both of you. You formed a bond with these souls. What are these, Dad? They're souls who could not be reincarnated, damned, or banished. They have no memory of their past life, but they can bond to us, and they're good at taking orders. We call them demons. Technically a special type of the lost. Wow. Isn't there some way to help them remember their past life? Yeah. Not that I've heard of. That's so sad. Don't worry, I'll find a way to restore your memories. Now oh, look at you, all nice and compassionate and nice. And compassionate. Isn't that lovely? Isn't it lovely? <laughs> Come on now. Uh, what now? 
You spoke and then you didn't. And then you... And then you lived your life. Whoa! Wait, am I about to relive the memory? Don't, don't do it again. Don't do it again! Please! What is it? Is this different? What's going on? I'm confused. Oh, no, oh, this is different. Oh, is this a new demon? Oh, dude, I freaking was on point with the guess. Look at this. I'm getting possessed! Ah! The soul of the demon Zav resonates with Kagachi, becoming his guardian. <laughs> Badass look at night. <laughs> Sign me up, buddy. Man, this demo is actually going for longer than I thought it would. I think, like, usually Switch demos don't really, like, I've never really, in my experience, had them last long. Zav, a demon with a strong sense of, or Zave, I, I'm pretty sure it's Zav, maybe. I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say Zav, alright, because that sounds a little bit more, yeah. A demon with a strong sense of justice and unwavering honesty. Even in death, the inner turmoil Zav felt in life is evident within him. He still holds distant memories of hatred suffered and deep regrets. Zav wields spears as he charges into the fray, and he doesn't flinch at taking a few hard hits. He can also leap into the air, enabling him to attack from land or sky. Well, that's, uh, that's pretty badass. <laughs> oh, are you about to... Whoa! Big fat boy! I guess we're about to find out whether or not we can wield two at the same time. A perfect chance to try out this new demon. Um... Use R to swap between the demons. You can manifest. Be sure to use the demon best suits the situation. Uh, of course. Uh, which... R? Wait, which one is it? Oh! Crappity balls! Wait, which... Boy, you are gonna piss me off. Dude, what the... Oh, I got you. Oh, now you can use... Okay, cool. Okay, that, that hurt. That hurt a lot. Yoink! Oh! Okay. I'll tell you one thing, man. This freaking uh, dude. This boss battle doesn't mess around. Oh, the freaking manifest! Holy crap! Manifest! <laughs> Time to die, boy! Shoulda. Oh my! I shoulda thought about that. You missed. Time to die! Dude, oh my gosh. Okay, come on, you can do it. You can do it. Finish off with the meteor. Oh no. Meteor. Mm -hmm. Um, well, dang. Ooh, 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 your boss fight was trivial and pathetic. Dude, that was, uh, I, I, I was into that. That was a pretty cool boss fight, buddy. I'm not gonna lie, man. Dude, I really like, like, the manifest actually lasts a pretty, uh, I mean, it, it lasts a pretty, pretty good bit. Wait a minute, I kinda wanna try something. Hold on a minute. If I get out of the veil right now, let me, let me save first before I make a mistake that I'll regret. Um, I want to see if I can fight the boss again if in the, in the other world. That would be kind of... I think it would be kind of funny. So, um, Oh, and so you need different stones, too, based on their weapon of choice. Nice! That's super dope. All right, well, we've got two sword stones for 
her booty. So, uh, wait, what? Oh, okay, I got you. I was like, dude, what, what, what? I was like, what are you doing, bro? Why aren't you doing anything, man? Ooh, hello. Increase the affinity gain when attacks hit. Uh, yes, please. Absa fruitly, dude. Now, what's the, I'm gonna take a guess that the next one is probably gonna be Demon Rank Up, Rank Two. Aisha's ability is enhanced when possessed. Oh. Demon rank. Your demon gained a rank. Each time a demon's rank increases, your bond with them deepens, and their capabilities with while possessed increase. Your demon will continue to gain ranks as you acquire new skills. Nice. No, it just costs one. All right. Perform a cross slash attack. Hold down the button before triggering to charge and increase the power. Oh, hot mama. Move back and unleash a shockwave with your demon. Uh... What the frickin' what now? Are you out of your mind, bro? I don't know which one to do. I'm gonna do this one. Oh, what is this null stone? I got a null stone. What is that? Oh, there's ones that start costing a little bit more. What's a null stone? That's what it, that's what it said it was, at least. The null stone? All I'm seeing are... It seems like it's, like, magic-based stuff. So I don't know. Wait a minute, what? Oh, is the Null Stone used for whichever demon you want? Oh, that's actually kind of cool, though. Yeah, I think it is. Okay, that's cool. You can assign it to four skills at once. New skills can be acquired using the skill tree. Go to the skill tree to acquire your first skill. Each skill is a cooldown that begins when you use the skill. The skill cannot be used again when the cooldown ends. Until the cooldown ends, choose a combination of skills that can complement each other on the battlefield. Absolutely. The Tranquil Mind. We're about to start Tranquil Minding these bitches, bro. I'm about to end that life. About to end that world. So yeah, the Null Stone seems to be some... Uh, it seems to be something that lets you use it for whichever one you want, which is pretty cool. Dang! His go all the way around. My guy. Increase power of jump attacks. You can move to cancel the delay after landing. What? Zav's memory is sealed within. Oh, okay. Evade for longer while jumping. Uh, skills triggered while manifested gain a manifestation effect. Oh, yeah, okay. That's a, That would actually probably be a really good one to have. Strike at your enemies as your demon attacks from above. Chance to stagger. Oh. Nice. Um, why don't we do the uh, the memory real quick? Let's go ahead and do the memory. Yeah. Sounds good to moi. To moi. Is it gonna? No. All right. Well, good talk. Aerial strike. Eh. Actually, maybe I don't want to. I don't want to use the null stone yet. We'll keep it how it is for right now. For right now, okay. Oh, wait, we're at Demon Lore. What am I doing? Yeah, you. Show me that Zav memory. What do we got? What do we got? Show me the way.
honestly, these memories and like their lore <laughs> seem like they could be part of like the dark, like the Dark Souls franchise or something. If you really wanted them to be, I suppose. Hmm. Well, all right, cool. That was nice. Uh, all right, let me try it. I'm gonna experiment. Uh, I don't think you can. Okay, well that makes sense though. That does make sense. It was worth a shot, okay? Oh, I kind of forgot that A was skill. Oh. Target. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, here we are. Here's my house. But what's the matter? Oh, oops. <laughs> I can't go back to their world, can I? That's why we're here. Just to stay, just stay close to me, okay? You can cross over into the living world for a bit if you stand near a watcher. Are you serious? Okay, we're ready. Let's go, Kagachi. Uh -oh. Why do I have a feeling his parents are dead? I mean, it just seems like the cliche way to progress the story. I mean, don't... Don't get on my case, alright? Oh, I wonder if there was extra dialogue there. Eh, well. Just the demo. Greetings. We're watchers and we have something to tell you. Oh, no, they're alive. Okay, never mind. <laughs> I'm a little bit dark, if you couldn't tell. Something about your son. We're sorry to bring such a sensitive subject up without warning. But we need you to keep praying that he'll journey safely into the next life. You need worry about that. We've been praying ever since he passed. We hope his next life will be a happy one. Mm. We aren't grieving, though. We wouldn't ha want him to lose his way. We want our happiness to be his guide. Let's hope so. Something happened? Um. Surely he's already crossed over by now. Yeah. I'm sorry to say he hasn't. In fact, he's right here by our side. But how? What happened? No. Dad. I want to go home. I want to come home. Don't cry. Stay strong. He's crying? Why is he crying? I'm all alone. I don't want to be alone anymore. He says he doesn't want to be alone. Gotcha, no! Whatever you're hiding from him is holding him back. But we... Honey, please, forgive me. I, I can't just leave our little boy all alone. This was a mistake. You know we can't bring him back. I do. Then you understand that you must go to him if you want to see him again. I understand. I'm ready. Wait, what? <laughs> ah, sniff! <laughs> so that's how it is. Okay. Alright. I guess it was always meant to be this way. I'll go to... I can't bear to leave him. I can't do it, Captain. I just can't. So you've made up your mind. We'll get to see him, won't we? I make no promises. Mm. Very well. I'm ready. Do as you will. As long as this puts his soul at ease, I am satisfied. Understood. Leave the rest to us. Thank you. 
Run away, son. Jeez, this is, uh, all right. Any objections? None. I'll do it. Oh! Just hold still. Oh, crap. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to end that. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to end the voice acting bit there. That was my bad. I thought he had stopped talking. Dude, that was actually really cool. That was really cool. I really like that. And, uh, yeah, wow, this took pretty much, like, just a little bit less. Like, just a little bit less than what the Final Fantasy VII demo took me. Unless this is about to be another... Or is this another... Is this a trailer showcase for the game? Wait, what is this? My grandma's really sick. We can't stand to watch her suffer. We're thinking of applying for, you know, the tithing. Ending her suffering early, you mean? Yeah. We've heard they give you a little bit of money for it since it helps the reincarnation. Well, in that case, it might be the best thing to do. I want you to have this. Oh my gosh, what is it? Charm. It's the latest thing. It'll help us meet again in the next world. Oh, thanks. That's really sweet of you. You're uh, welcome. I'm glad you like it. Say, have you caught that murdering creature yet? The night something or other? Oh, the night devil? Pfft, don't worry about the likes of us. I was watching us get up soon enough. You'll see. Is it true that you can't pass beyond the veil if the night devil kills you? Eh, who cares? Listen to me, this is serious. Join the Ark of Hope and guarantee your passage in the afterlife. It's the only way to ensure you'll be reincarnated with your friends and family. The Ark of Hope can save you. Join us for a meeting. Yes, join us. <laughs> what is happening right now? <laughs> Wait, is the demo not over? What? What's happening right now? No, it's gotta be over. What the heck? What the flip and frick crackety mac and what? Did you hear the latest, Kagachi? The night devil bagged another one. Quit talking like that. You must really like killing. I said quit it. Come on, knock it off. You wouldn't like them when they're angry. Yeah. Oh no, not death talk. Anything but death talk. You want me to send you both off for good? Oh, You're just joking. It was all a joke. Sweet souls, you are terrifying. Come on, we're out of here. Yeah, move it on. You cloth-wrapped looking thingy. Idiots. You don't have an ounce of the willpower you do, Kagachi. Is that a female? I can't, I can't tell. <laughs> I'm over it. Don't worry about taking them on. Ah, uh, yes. We know you've had to make tough choices. You're good people. Everyone knows it. They're hopeless, anyway. You two should go get some rest. You've earned it. Kuro Marsh is really nice. Deep in the heart of it, there's an area just bursting with gorgeous flowers. Hey, what are you doing? I thought that was our secret spot. <laughs> oh, stop it. There's no harm in telling them. Boy. You heard nothing. Got that? Uh -huh. Don't be stupid, Jigari. Mm -hmm. Look out for Kagachi, okay? And come find me at the first sign of any trouble. Arigato. Thank you so much. I love you guys. He back at you. We'll see you later. 
Oh, look at that. Look at that. Isn't that so cute? Okay, I'm gonna head off too. We should get some rest. Ah, yes, the restage of the rest. What the flip, dude? The freaking demo isn't over? Alright, well, okay. Work's finally finished. I think I'll have myself a proper map once I'm home. I feel for you. Then again, I bet the only thing on your mind is closing this case. Maybe it's better that way. This place has a nice view. I stop by here from time to time to relax. Without peace of mind, we cannot hope to bring peace to others. Ah, oh, yes. Once you've visited the secret spot, you'll never forget it. It's beautiful. Try to keep it secret, okay? Can't believe how stupid they are. The nerd. Do it if you frickin'. Kira Marsh is a lovely place. Now that you've finished up your summit, maybe you and Mayura should go check it out. Yeah, well, thanks. That's cute and sweet. Yeah? Huh. Unusual for you to start a conversation. Here, I'd pegged you as the quiet loner type. Alright, how about you shut your mouth before I chop off your balls? I'm gonna castrate you like a cow. Peter. Don't, don't cancel me, please. Okay. Uh, well, this is weird. What is oh, wow. Come with me, all of you. Those fools in the Ark of Hope have lost their minds. What have they done now? The disciples have taken their own lives without authorization. Who is among them? I don't have names. There are 30 dead already. What? We had watchers keeping an eye on them and everything. Can't believe this is happening. We have to hurry. Kagachi, I want you to check the area and see if any of the dead have become lost. Make your way to the northern plaza and the ruins. Hitoa and Jigari, you talk to the disciples down below and figure out what's going on. Understood. Let's go, Jigari. Moving out. I want the rest of you to secure the area. Kujo, you're in command. I have to report to Leo. Alrighty. Yeah, this is a pretty long demo. If it hasn't ended here already. Then again, I guess I would probably be going through it a bit quicker if I wasn't doing literally everything. But do not kill me for it. I am a completionist. I must do it. Oh boy. You can instantly travel to various destinations using the world map. Simply examine a waystone, select fast travel, and move to the world map. Oh, uh, what? Yeah, I'm not gonna... Uh, wait a minute. Wait, what? Waystones mark the boundary between the living world and the beyond. Here you can commune with your demons and prepare them for battle. Oh, yes, nice. Using waystones. Additional commands are available while at a waystone. Party. Manage your demons here. Use R to shift between demons during battle. <coughs> Excuse me. Demon lore. Commune with your demons, talking with them, and reliving their memories. Fast travel. Allows you to move between waystones within the same map or return to the world map. Difficulty. You can adjust the game's difficulty here. Enemies will respawn at the newly selected difficulty. Save. Save your progress. Ah, yes. Let me save that sweet, sweet, you know what I'm saying? Okay. Um. Yeah, I'm sorry. I don't want to... I don't want to make this overly complicated. Moving between maps. Selecting fast travel allows you to go to the world map and move between any waystones you've previously visited. Yeah, we're just going to go straight to... I'm not going to dilly-dally. I can do that if... If and when I get the full game, we can kind of go around that area and explore it a little bit. But for the sake of the demo and time purposes and everything, we will do our best to kind of cut corners now. Since I didn't expect the demo to be this long. Mm, what? Oh, up here. I'm guessing. 
it didn't really give me an objective marker, so. Uh, what? Uh, where do I go? Maybe is it down? Might be down a little bit. Come on now! Load! Please! I wouldn't say the loading times are bad, but sometimes it feels like they might, you know, it feels like they kind of last a little bit longer than maybe they should. So... Um... Sorry, I don't know. Honest, we were just told to rec we were just told to recruit nothing more. I don't think anyone's told them the whole story. Ignorant or not, we can't allow them to keep up their recruiting. They say they don't. They say they don't know anything. After everything that's happened to their friends, how awful. Um. um well, without a proper objective. How in the balls am I supposed to um, find my objective? Hello? Oh. I hope I don't have to talk to a bunch of people to figure it out. I kind of like don't want to do that right now. No, cool out today. Oh, shut your face. Okay. Are you serious right now? Okay, well, it seems that I have been pegged for a moron. Because it seems as though either way I was going to be doing a little bit of exploring. Oh, come on. You watch the shoe do work at your own pace. Yes, thank you very much, lady. Um, oh, there we go. Maybe? Something like that? Nope. What the frick? You know, you'd think it'd try to frickin' give you an objective thing, so that way you know where it is. But no, instead they're just like, hey, you wanna suck? You wanna suck, suck? <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, we do, freaking. I'm yawning. Help. Whoa! Tepo Ruins. Lost Town. Oh. oh. Okay, cool. Rome Meadows, Temple Ruins. Here's the Veil. Okay, I got you. Oh, oops. Wait, what? Why, what the crap is happening right now? Uh, what the frick? No, don't leave. Come on. Okay, yeah, okay, I get it, I know, but I can't pierce the frickin' veil if I'm vulnerable and got blindness. I don't want to die. Uh. Excuse me. Time to die, birds! Taking that big suck. But 
Jump down! Mmm, and that does a lot of damage. That does a lot of damage. Alright, well there's the uh, Nexus crap hole. Oh, I did that. I did that wrong. What a waste. Damn it! And this thing is tanky as balls. Yeah, get friggin' smacked, boy. Die! Give me that sweet, sweet. Well! Trying to ambush me with a bunch of crows, are you? <laughs> That's cute. Alright, you could stop with the crows at any time. Please. I don't know if actually... In the world was that... All right, time to cross into that. <laughs> time to cross into the big poopy. What the frickin' hell was that? Dude, are you trying to piss me off right now? Are you freaking serious? I was right next to the damn Nexus, bro. Oh, now I'm triggered. That was stupid. That was really freaking stupid, dude. Was I not next to the veil? Or the frickin' Nexus. I was literally right next to it when I switched. That's bull. That is bull, dude. Oh my gosh, I'm pretty sure I have to do that again. Awesome! Congratulations, you have found the one sure way to piss me off. Really. You've, you've done it successfully. You've done a great job. Frickin' stupid, bro. That is actually stupid. I am triggered right now with that. Dang, dude. That's stupid that that's even a thing in the pers in the first place, like. You serious? That must have, like, bugged out or something, bro. Like, I literally spawned right in the middle of enemies. Ah, oh, that's so annoying, dude. Then, of course, it registers as me being a freaking idiot, so I just, like, died. Ow, you freaking asshole. Come on now. Yeah, I'm gonna do it again. It's your time to die. Suck my chungus. Okay. CL. Dude, I must have literally been like right. I must have been like right here or something. Oh, that's annoying, dude. Can't attack and defense while floating. Oh. That's interesting. It's 
it's basically more of an incentive, if, if anything, to switch to the other, to, to switch to Zav. But I don't really feel like doing that. That's right, die! Ooh. What are you doing there, brother man? You ready to die? you very much for the patronage. What the heck is going on? Oh, there we go. I was like, bro. Get destroyed. C Don't run away from me. What the heck do you think you're doing? You must be out of your damn mind, cuh. Whoa! What are you doing there, brother man? Ah, uh, yes. Yoink. Might as well use it. Use the healing incense. Do it. Uh, uh excuse you? Ah, yes. More healing incense. Um. I almost wonder if I should or should not be transferring into the other world right now. Oh, yeah, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep, yeah. big sexy time. Dude, this freaking. Oh my gosh. This demo is lasting quite a hot minute. What do you got for me? Are you one of the disciples? Yeah, where is everybody? You're the only one I found. I think the others have already crossed over. Oh. Anyone with unfinished business like you was left behind, so tell me what's on your mind. Right. That makes sense. What does? Well, I was nervous because he wasn't here. Who wasn't here? The navigator. He said he would be here to lead us, but I didn't see him. Maybe he crossed over with the others. Yeah, maybe. You don't sound convinced. It's just a feeling, but there was something strange about the way he acted. Strange how? Sometimes he would hide away in the altar room by himself. When I peeked in, he wasn't there. And then all of a sudden, he'd come walking right out as if nothing had happened. It's so why all this sneaking around unless you had something to hide. No. Wait, forget I said that. The Navigator wouldn't hide anything from us. I know he wouldn't. Why well, deny it now? There's no need to hide your doubts. You think there's a reason you haven't seen him since you died? Yeah. Good. Now it falls to me to end your doubts. Where is the quay? Quay? Where is the quay? Where is the quay? It's west of here. Think the navigator's there? If he's not, that means he crossed over ahead of you, and you'll need to accept that. Okay. Would it be alright if I went with you? I'd like to see the navigator. That's the idea. It's the only way you'll understand. Uh, alrighty. I don't really feel like engaging in dialogue. So, unless it is with an important individual. Ah, yes. I'd get with you, but I need to stay here and take command. Make sure you do a thorough... Make sure to do a thorough investigation. Not that you need me to tell you that. I know you will. Haha. <laughs> okay. Shut up. Yay! Forget. Is there any point to breaking those boxes? I don't think that there is. Do you need to be using the other demon in order to uh, um gain like those spear stones? Like, do I need to be using Zob in order to get the spear stones, 
Or do I just get them over time? Whoa! Big Chungus! And he's definitely not, not a Nexus or anything like that. He's just Big Chungus. He's Big Chungus with an agenda. He's Big Chungus who's about to die! Yeah, yeet! Okay, so you can't end you can't end and, and oh my gosh, you can't end manifestation early. Just if anybody was curious. Skills awaken. What the flip? When you use a skill, it has a chance to awaken, triggering a variety of possible effects. Chosen at random. These effects can turn the tide of battle, so be sure to make good use of them. What are you talking about? What has happened and why? What are you talking about right now? You better explain yourself. Unless you want to die. Ah, yes, there is Big Chungus. Yeah, yeet! Level up. Yeah, yeet. Okay. Oh, hello there. Well, hello there. Do not hit me with your petty fireballs. Okay, there is one thing I am finding myself slightly, like, ever so slightly concerned about. And that would probably be that I feel like this game definitely could get repetitive very quickly. Um, so that's kind of where my problems are starting to lie, is the fact that I'm pretty sure that this game can get uh, quite possibly pretty boring pretty quickly, um, just because things do feel kind of... Um, repetitive. And, you know, that's not necessarily a bad thing. Like, you know, there are certain people out there that just, you know, love the good grind, you know? No problem with that. Um, I just think that, like, for me, I'm starting to notice that, like, you know, it's already kind of falling a little bit stale for me, personally. Um, so. And that's not anything to say that it's not a bad game at all, of course. It's just that, like, the combat is not super, uh, you know. Oh, come. I missed that completely. Are you serious right now? Woo! You just got smacked, son. Um, I'm gonna be completely honest with you, um, with how long this demo is lasting, I'm probably, uh, I'm probably just gonna upload this raw, you know, um, especially if I wanna be able to work on some other things. I mean, obviously, you know, you'll very quickly find out which one of these I decided to go ahead and upload, either the Final Fantasy or this demo for today, um... But either way, I mean, yeah, I don't know. I'm thinking that I'll probably just... Since both of them were pretty much hour-plus-long demos to play and everything, i um, probably just going to upload them raw. I'll run through them really quick just to make sure things are working okay, but, um, yeah, I think I'm going to plan on just doing it raw. Yeah, see? You see what I'm saying? I'm, like, kind of not really talking all that much. I'm just kind of... Yeah, I'm not... It's like, I don't know. I just... I wouldn't say that I'm, like, super bored with the gameplay. But it's, like, it's just evident that it's not, you know... I can just tell that if I were to buy it, um, I would probably lose my attention 
with it. Like, like I would, I would have to take it in spurts, for sure. I wouldn't be able to play. I wouldn't be. It wouldn't be a game that I'd be able to grind or anything. Which is probably for the best, anyway. You know, not always grinding a game is the best option. You know what I'm saying? All right, cool. We'll just go ahead and save here, and then hopefully this will be the end of the demo, because holy moly. Oh. Um. Let's see what we got going on here. I'm going to take a guess it's going to give us one more boss fight, probably, and then the demo will end. But I'm going to be honest, I mean, if I would have obviously known that it lasted this long, I, prom I probably would have broken this up into two parts. Although it's kind of unusual to do a demo in two parts, you know? I mean, I guess if it's long enough, then obviously you would want to do that, but... I mean, like, just... Ugh. Sorry. I'm speaking my mind! Blech. Especially when I still have to, you know, at least get the videos compiled and everything. It's kind of, uh... Bit of a cuck for the demo to last this long. <laughs> uh, I have a feeling that we should probably save. My thought process lies in the fact that we should probably save. Lest we would regret it. Okay. Holy crap! Quite a lot of enemies there, brother man. You're mainly a ranged beast. You hold no power over me. Oops. Didn't mean to do that. Hee hee hee. Die! game just has a lot of depth to it, man. Holy balls. Yes, use that veal, 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 pair, pair, that veil, pair through. Use the veil, pair through. Uh-oh. My freaking tax knock back enemies at a great distance. Holy crap, dude. Yeah, well, I can certainly tell that much. Holy balls. But who's to say that that necessarily benefits, benefits me? I swear I don't have a stutter. I feel like I've been stuttering a bunch. Whoa! Big Chungus! How you doing? How about you die? Thanks. Oh, jeez, I forgot. Okay, I forgot that the precepts apply to everybody. So, even attacks on me will knock me back. I do realize I'm at 168%, okay? I'm not stupid. I'm just kind of lazy. <laughs> That's the way to put it. I imagine that's probably spamming dash is the way to live life. Do not even think about hitting me with that BS cup. Yeah, you. Come on now, quit moving, Kerr. Yeah, you. Your attacks are so worthless. They can't do anything to me. Whoa! Look at you. So pathetic. You smuck. You smuck my schmung. Ooh. Yeah. 
Mais la plus belle. The crows, they've arrived. Whoa! Am I not supposed to be able to get through that yet? Probably not, if it didn't seem obvious enough. Whoa! Okay, well, that happened. Boom! Combo them skills, cuh. Jeez. Oh, boy, this is really starting to... This is really starting to... Ah, crap! It gets, get a little bit stale. Get a little bit stale, my guy. I just want to... just want this demo to end. <laughs> and granted, I know I keep saying that and then I'm trying to do everything, but... Shut up, alright? I'm a completionist. I must, I must do it for the sake of my life and living and... Loving and living again. I have no idea what that gave me. But oh, does it cap out at two hundred percent? Seems that is what it has done. I'm, I've been saving it for the boss. I have a feeling I'm gonna counter a boss. So even though I probably could have refilled it by now if I had used it before, but eh. that's ooh uh, yeah, that needs to be uh, immediately sauvéed. Sauvéed, huh? Give me that savage. Actually, wait a minute. Let's leave. Oh my gosh. On rare occasions, shadow may appear in the living world. If you enter the beyond while tainted by shadow, you'll face special fallen. Defeat them to claim rich rewards? Wait, what? I must have already done it. <laughs> I did it before it could even tell me. That's hilarious. Although I don't remember the... Yeah, I already killed it, my guy. I don't think I... Yeah, I don't think that there's uh, much that I can really do there in that department. Alright, just think of it this way, okay? Because I'm being so thorough, when it, if and when I get the full game, I'm going to be decked the balls out. Decked the balls with bowels of holly. Wait, deck the balls with... Wait, is that how it goes? Something like that. Obviously not actually deck the balls, but, you know, protect the balls, please. Deck your fellow man's balls. Come on now. <laughs> I've been sitting at 200% for a while now. At this point, I'm kind of wasting my manifest, but... Not really too worried about it, if I'm being honest. Okay. Level seven. Holy crap, dude! Pretty sure you have to enter the veil to see the portal, right? And I don't remember saving, so let me do that real quick. Holy crap! Yeet.
Get wrecked. Wait, what? Did new ones just spawn you, freaking Chungus? Die. Come on now. Quit moving. Holy crap, dude. I don't know what the heck the, uh, oh, oops, that's not what I meant to do. I don't know what the heck breaking the stuff and, like, what, I don't know what that does for me, if I'm being honest. I'm kind of confused by what it does, if anything. Come on now, hurry up and die. Sight stealer found? Oh. Look at that. Hey, you! Are you f You bitch! Sight stealage, cut. Beep. Beep. Sight stealing. Big balls. Big glorious balls. Run away, unless you want to die. A debuff attack? What even is that? Whoa! Damn it, dude. Quit frickin' moving, you chungus. I was like, dude, are you going to give me the thing or not? Oh, boy. Who the balls? Is this a boss? It's not a boss, but... Yeah, I don't think you can just dodge. All right, well, you're tanky, though. Tell me that that ain't stupid, because it is. Bro, you're going to freaking piss me off. Here's your manifestation. Fine! All right, manifest right now. Time to fucking die. Should have thought about that, huh? Yeah, should have thought about that. We should probably make sure that there isn't anything back here. Because you know me, I'll regret it otherwise. Oh, hello. 
smaving. Boom. Okay, you definitely do move a lot faster when your stuff is sheathed down. I should probably do that more often. Oh. Oh. Good sir, is that the navigator? Is that a lot of gold? What is that? Are you the one they call the navigator? Yeah, well, um, why do you ask? No games. You know why I'm here. Do I? You just killed a bunch of your followers. That was something they did of their own accord. I said no games. I brought a witness. A, a witness, you say? A child. He's waiting for you. You said you'd join him beyond the veil. Ah, him. So you know him. Your move, then. If you want to keep your promise, I can send you off right here and now. As if you had the right to do such a thing. I do. I'm a watcher. I hold the laws of reincarnation above all else. Wait, wait, wait! Please grant me the mercy of life. Please, I beg of you. It sounds like your navigator never intended to join you. It does. Bathing in. That must be quite the surprise. Do you see now? Yeah, I guess some part of me secretly doubted his words all along. I, I feel pretty stupid. <laughs> There's always the next life. Thank you, I think. It's strange to hear someone say that to me out loud. I'm ready to go now. I think I can still catch up to the others. I hope I'll get to see you again once I'm reincarnated. That's a lovely thought. But there are no guarantees. No. You didn't say it won't happen. There's a chance, right? You've got me there. I... Then I'll hope for the best. Farewell. Boy. Come with me. You can tell your side of the story at the trial. Time to die! Isn't that hilarious? And stupid. How long have we been going for, man? Let me check. Almost an hour and 40 minutes now, dude. Holy hell, man, this is a long demo. This is literally, I think, the longest demo I've ever played. Ever. Ever. I got your message. I assume this is the Ark of Hope's navigator? Everything is in order for the trial. We should make our way to the courtroom at once. Yes, invisibly put those cuffs on him. Indeed. It's her. Hey, the little girl. The little girl. Girl! The girl! Go find the girl! The girl who came to me when I was young. She hasn't aged a day. He's all yours, Kushi. I need to take care of something. Oh Look at you! What? <laughs> yeah, well, I did the cutscene anyway for me. That's great. Fantastic. Awesome. Lovely. <laughs> little girl! Girl! Where have you gone, little girl? You and I must have speech. Where'd you go? Is that from the game? What the hell was that noise? You look so peaceful. I'm glad you passed without pain. I'll keep on keeping on so I can tell you some stories about the future you didn't get to see. Once I've got enough of them, well, then I'll come join you. I love you. I've always loved you. Well, that was depressing. <laughs> ah, yes, little girl. Hello. I've come for your... something. 
That's all, I guess. I don't know why this freaking girl's cute. <laughs> She's so tiny and adorable. Who? What's going on? What the heck is happening? Whoa! Oh, damn. What's happening here? Why does he look like something out of freaking Assassin's Creed? What just happened? What what was that interaction? What? Uh, <laughs> this is the end of the demo version. Thanks for playing. So this is where you end the demo. Okay. All right. Awesome. Great. Fantastic. Save the progress. Absolutely. Thank you very much. Awesome. Great. No, at least not right now. Oh, dear me, oh my. Yeah, this is 100% just getting uploaded. Raw Battle mode? Yeah, I don't even think I want to, dude. I do not wish to do the things that you do. Um... Any jokes aside, uh, that was really good. That was, it was, it was, it was pretty good. Um, the, some of the cutscenes are, like, a little bit something out of, like, a mobile game, <laughs> if you get what I'm saying. Um, and then, I don't know, I liked, I liked the gameplay, though. Um, the story seems pretty interesting. Um, the mechanics in the game, I think that those are pretty cool, I like that. Um, but, uh, yeah, it, I, I'm definitely, yeah, it definitely can feel, not necessarily grindy, because I think that there's a, a distinct difference between, like, something that's a grind and something that's repetitive. I mean, obviously. I mean, they kind of can go hand in hand, but, like, I don't know. This this definitely comes across as something that would get pretty repetitive for me, though. Um, but, I mean, yeah, it was, it was a pretty good game. It was a pretty good game. If you can, uh, you know, if you have enough space, you want to try it out for yourself, try out the demo, go right ahead. But without further ado, hope you all have a good night. A good morning, good afternoon, wherever the hell you are, whatever the hell you be doing. Peace out, y'all.